This is Pastor Rodney. This morning I want to talk to you on the topic, Take Me Back. Take Me Back. You know, I want to ask you a question. Have you ever known anyone that maybe when you first knew them, maybe you didn't appreciate them, maybe you didn't value them, or maybe that person didn't value you, and circumstances happen and you separate. You separate, you go your separate ways, you live your life, they live their lives. But one day, you come across each other. And in that moment, although you haven't spent any time developing the joy, the intimacy, the closeness, you realize in that moment, you miss it. You know, before we get carried away, I'm really not talking about the relationship between a man or a woman. But I'm really talking about, do you miss your relationship with God? There's a song when I was a kid that they used to sing that says, take me back, take me back to the place where I first receive you. The book of Revelation talks about remember your first love. Remember the one who first opened your eyes to see clearly the day you were born again. See, sometimes after salvation, We can become so encumbered with the affairs of this life. In fact, at one point, Jesus had to speak to Martha and says, Martha, Martha, you are busy with so much stuff, but Mary has chosen the better part. And just like Martha, many times we get caught up in the things and the affairs of life and the to-dos and the agenda that we tend to drift away from that which is most important, and that is our relationship with God. That should become first more than anything else. In fact, Jesus says that if you want to be his disciples, you must love him more than you love anyone or anything else. See, because we can often get distracted. So today I want to talk to you about remembering where you came from. Remembering the day that he saved your soul. The day that he made you whole. Remembering the day that he brought life and light into your life and that time was so fresh, so new something you've never experienced before. Truly, it had left an indelible imprint in my life. Thinking about the day that I first received him, Jesus Christ, my Lord. And so today, I'm praying, God, take me back. Take me back to that place where it was only you and I. Take me back to that place where the joys of just knowing that you are near was more than enough. Because I don't want to get distracted during this time. Everything that's going on in the world and everything that's happening on the news can be disheartening. But if you can remember who called you in the first place. If you can remember the one who says, I will never leave you or forsake you, then even in this time, 
you can smile and feel confident that as long as God is near, I shall not fear. So today, I pause, I reflect, and I emerge to life in the precious name of Jesus. Jesus.